Hey guys and what is up, Inspire here and hope you're all having a fantastic day today. In this video, I'm going to show you how to calculate your profitability on your GPUs or how to calculate your return on investment. Um, so in this video, we're going to use a website called what to mine um, In this website, you can just um, punch in how many cards you have and you can see uh, how much mega hash or wattage um, in regards to the cards and it will calculate how much well, or what would be the most profitability um, to mine so in this video I'm going to quickly show you just in regards into my rig I'm going to punch in my 3060 TIs the LHR versions and see what the profitability is okay so if you guys um, haven't been to what to mine before I'm going to quickly just drop the link down below um, in the description below so you can um, just go there and play around with it and see how much you'll make on the cards that are available on the website okay without further ado let's jump into the website and let's play around with it and we'll go from there okay okay so here's the website and this is what it looks like and how it calculates the proper the profitability um, in regards to how much you make um, with the cards that you're mining with so for example here you have like most of the the six series card from amd and then you have the 3000 series um, which are nvidia so as as I said, I'm going to punch in my 6 3060 Ti's here. So this is the 3060 Ti um, with the LHR version. Um, if, you had, if you just have a normal 3060 Ti, then you can just use the one next to it and then punch in how many cards you have there. Okay, so I'm going to put in six cards here. And also I'm going to tick this box here to highlight to make it green. So as you see, so there's six cards and then it's green and then now it puts in um, or the the hash rates or it, it pre pre calculates everything in as like standard um, within the coins that you can mine and all that so we're just looking at, at ethereum and also we're going to look at um, raven coin on the kapow um, algorithm to see how much these card roughly makes and see what the best um the best coin is to mine okay so at the moment i have it on raven coin um, as you've seen in my previous videos so i built a specific 6 um, 3060 ti lhr for the raven um just to farm just to farm the raven coin okay all right so all we need to do now is just double check that it's pre-calculated and then we can check here in regards to the cost as well so how much how much does electricity cost in your city or in your country you can put it down in here as well so i'm just going to leave it as um 10 cents per kilowatt um as i know a lot of people um, have electricity at about 10 cents per kilowatt um that's an average but um let's quickly click the calculate and see what's the most profitable coin to farm okay Okay, as soon as you click calculate, it will calculate the coins um, to see what's the most profitable coin. So at the moment, you can see Ryo is probably one of the, the most co the top coin to farm at the moment. Um, you get a you get twenty two dollars and fifty cents before power and eighteen dollars and seventy six cents after power. So my cards at the moment is running on Kapow um, farming um, Raven coin. Um, so just hoping that um, Ravencoin will go up in the future. So that's what my rig's running at the moment. But as you can see, these are the top the top coins to farm with the the cards that we have at the moment. So you have Rio, you have Firo, you have Flux, you have Ethereum. Yep, and then you can and then you can keep on going down to see the list of what what's most profitable. Um, as said, I'm farming on Ravencoin, and then. I'm getting and yielding about 151 coins per day. Um, that calculates roughly about $15 and 65 cents um, after the, the power. So that's not too bad, not too bad. Um, but as I said, you know, I'm just farming Raven at the moment and just hoping um, to hold the coins and then hoping that Raven would um, go up in the future. Okay, so that was just on profitability and to see how much um, we can make out of our cards on um, on the algorithm and just to see which one's the best one to, to mine. But now I'm going to show you how do you calculate the return on investment, which people call that the ROI. So just to see how much one card costs and how long it will take to mine the money back for that card. For example, let's jump into Ravencoin. If you click Ravencoin over here, so once you're in this page, you can calculate the return on investment or the break even point. So as down here, you can see there's break even and how many days it will tell you that it will break even. For example, we have um, 
the hash rate here. So this was for 6, um, 63060 Ti, the LHR version. So I'm just quickly bringing up the calculator and then we can just calculate how much six cards cost and then we can see what the return on investment will be. Okay, so here's the calculator. So for example, how much does a 3060 Ti LHR cost? Um, roughly it will cost about $680 for a card at the moment. Like on Best Buy, I can see there are a few 3060 Ti's that cost about $680. So we're just going to go with that for, for example. So we go 680, it times it by six cards. That's how many cards I have. So it will cost $4,080. So all we have to do now is the hash rate is pre-calculated on six already, the power is already there, the cost at 10 cents per kilowatt and then we just have to put the price in the hardware cost so let's just double check how much the hardware cost was again so 4080 so we'll put in 4080 dollars and then we'll hit calculate so once we calculate it will show us how much the break even um, point is or the return on investment is okay so as you can see it's the six cards um, for the 3060 Ti's LHR version, um, it, it will break even just over, you know, 250 days. So 259. So we we'll just we'll, we'll just call it 260 days. So to break even, you gotta have to mine for 260 days. And if the price stays the same at, at what Raymond is at the moment, it will take 260 days to mine, like to pay off your cards all right so your return on investment will be 260 days and then whatever you make after that will be profit so is it still a good time to mine that's what you guys have to decide okay um i'm not here to give any financial advice or i'm not a financial advisor or an ex expert but if you guys are happy to buy cards during this time and to start mining then go for it so there you have it you guys know how to calculate your profitability you know how to calculate your return on investment um, just to look at um, this website you know come to this website um, play around with it and see if it's worth mining or if it's worth buying cars to come and mine thank you guys for dropping by once again if you guys like the video don't forget to give it a thumbs up if you guys haven't subscribed click that subscribe button and also don't forget to click that bell notification so you know when I drop a new video I'll see you guys in the next one